We've worked as a, as a council, as a city, to, to be very transparent about what we're dealing with and what we're working with, including starting with the, um, the budget that brought out that 6.97% indicative rate that uh, was based on all the information we had in the spring about what we were facing and then what steps were we've been taking to bring that down because we know just as we're seeing attention pressure on our budgets or our citizens and we want to do everything we can to uh, bring in a budget that is um, shows as much value as possible for what people are providing and recognizes that, that everybody's in a pinch right now. What, what is your reaction to the number 4.96%? It's higher than I'd like, there's no question, especially given the circumstances we're in. Um, I know why we've gotten to that point and we're going to still have some discussions about what we can potentially do to, to bring it down. Um, and uh, we, the civic parts of the budget themselves are below inflation, but we're facing uh, and challenged by some of these additional uh, pressures and the, the reduction in revenues that the city is facing right now is having a, a real impact. And that's not just related to the provincial government. There's a number of factors there, but uh, this is the reality that we're facing. And uh, from what I know, citizens want to have quality of life and they want to see the value of the tax dollars that they put in. And that's our job as a city, is to demonstrate what we're doing to improve upon that. And one thing I am hearing is, is if we look at the Im improvements to roadways, to sidewalks, to our old crumbling infrastructure, and some of the neighborhoods and, and parts of the city, and this isn't just the oldest neighborhoods, but even neighborhoods that uh, are in suburban areas that are seeing those improvements, we need to show value for what people are, are getting and spending, and, and that's our ongoing job. And, uh, and to continue to find a way to deliver services as efficiently and effectively as we can, and, and we're going to continue to do that.